Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and tonight is going to be a time saver for you if you watch this series. This is the first part. I had, just a couple of days ago, I posted a, a video where I had to write on this edge, and this is this edge, and I had to do it 50 times. And the customer was real particular on the font and size, so she sent me a PDF, and it just imported it perfectly, I mean, I had to break them apart and group them together, but I could do all that because this, this running took a long time. So I had plenty of time to work, mess with that, but I had to take each one of the, each one of these squares and this, the red box is my laser line with my lid open. So I know I'm on that box. So if you haven't watched the other videos, you might want to watch them. It was a pretty neat build of a jig, but I had to take them. I had to put them in this left hand corner and, took just a few seconds, but I had to make sure it was snapped and, and I was so particular, I'd actually zoom in and make sure it's there. And then I had to zoom out. So tonight I thought the next time I do that, I'm going to make a macro. So what I did, I made a macro and I actually made an icon. So there's going to be two or three videos in this series. So all you have to do is select that item and hit your macro it goes right in that corner. I'm ready for the, I've run the laser job. I'm going to press P on the keyboard. I'm going to take my name and move it out of the way. I'm going to get my next name, hit P on the keyboard. I'm going to hit my macro. See, you've got to get them both. Well, you don't. If you're not going to test every one of them, you don't have to do that. But if you're going to test, then you need to, if you're going to run a test around most of them, then you need to do that. Well, that's top left corner. Hit P on the keyboard. Move the name out of the way. I always do this so I'll know which one I've ran. Get the next name. P on the keyboard. Select them both. Hit your icon. Boom. You know it's in the top left corner. So stay tuned for the other videos. Help you learn. Help, help you. I hope you learned a little bit. Thank you for watching.